if it happens again, I'm going to be like, no, I'm, I've got to find a different job. A fast food employee talks to Action 3 News hours after a Pizza Hut robbery in Dundee. It comes just weeks after a holdup at the Pizza Hut near 60th and Ames. That location is now closed. Good evening, I'm Craig DeGrelli. And I'm Jennifer Griswold. Trying to make a living turned dangerous last night. Now one man is speaking out about his frightening ordeal. KMTV Action 3 News reporter Emily Zink is live near 50th and Underwood with his story. Emily? Well, Jen, Craig, it was closing time here at the Pizza Hut near 50th in Underwood when Jamie McDonald says his crew couldn't even get out the door before being held up. Well, when I saw the gun, I'm like, great, we're getting robbed. Two men wearing all black with their faces covered walked in and ordered the employees to head downstairs. And so we started heading towards back and then went downstairs. I'm like, okay, get the money out of the safe. I'm like, well, the safe's upstairs. So we turned around. Back up steps. While the assistant manager, Jamie McDonald, a cook, and the two suspects were downstairs, a driver was still upstairs and made a run for it. He, they weren't paying attention to him, so he ran out the door and he said he started calling 911. While the employee was outside calling for help, the robbers were inside demanding cash. The only problem, McDonald didn't have access to the safe, and the register wasn't cooperating. And they're like, you're doing that purposely. I'm like, no, I'm not. It's the computer is messing up. The drawer wouldn't open for McDonald, and the robbers got annoyed. The one guy that was um, shorter said, screw it, I'm, I'm out of here, and took off running out the door. The other was still in the store, mad that he couldn't get money. He pistol whipped McDonald before leaving the store. I got uh, hit right here, right here with the um, gun. McDonald says he is putting last night's incident in the past. He hopes it never happens again, but he'll be prepared if it does. It's like, okay, just cooperate with them, get them what they need and get out of there. And then once they're gone, call the cops. Jamie says his head still hurts, but he's actually at work right now. Police say they're still looking for those two suspects. So if you have any information about this attempted robbery, please call Crime Stoppers at 444-STOP. Reporting live in Dundee, Emily Zink came to be Action 3 News.